Welcome back, Rock Stars, to some more Anubis Pixamon. Today, we've got a storyline to continue from a couple episodes ago, so let's go ahead and dive right into it. So, if you guys remember a few storylines or a couple episodes back, we did the Tale of Three Birds storyline. We started it, and a lot of you guys actually seemed really intrigued by it, and so was I. So, I'm super excited to go ahead and continue working on that today. So, to get access, we need to first of all go ahead and do slash storyline, and then there, here we are, storylines, the Tale of Three Birds. So let's go ahead and get right back into it. It. So last time when we were here, we chose our team and we chose Team Galarian Articuno, not only because it was my favorite just original legendary bird Pokemon, but out of the typings of all of these, it's my favorite since it's psychic. So I think it's really cool. So we got a lot of goals today. All right, so we need to craft a iron bucket, get 25, uh, 20 coal and 15 lapas. So, and we're gonna have to give it to this guy. So that shouldn't be too hard. Let's go ahead and get onto it. Okay, well, we have the iron, so we need the 15 lapis and the 20 coal, which shouldn't be too hard. We just gotta find, I don't think they're in this section of the mine. I think they're in the uh, that section of the mine. Just gotta find where the right ores and the right locations are. Ah, here's coal. So we need to get 20 of these, which isn't going to be a big deal overall. Luckily, there's no, we don't have to worry about like smelting especially with coal because it doesn't have a smelting so that's nice this is actually gonna go really really quick so that's good so 20 of these isn't too bad now we, after this we just got to get the 15 lapis and then craft ourselves an iron bucket and we should be able to be good and move on oh, i was trying to find the lapis it's flipping underwater no wonder i couldn't see it okay oh and they only give you one lapis per instead of the groups like it's supposed to oh that's annoying okay so we got to do this 15 times and underwater that makes it even slower but it's just what we're gonna have to do it's not too bad though i just wasn't expecting lapis to be hidden under the water and this should be our very last lapis there we go that's 15 20 coal so now let's get up here and do what we need to do so first of all an iron bucket give me that thank you very much and now we just go over to this guy and ah wonderful this domed armor is nearly done just needing it to get that helm right then and i'll be right with you well, now you've brought me those upgrade materials, I can get to work on those finishing touches. Of course, it won't be done right away. These things take time. So go make yourself an iron sword in the meantime while I work. Uh, I am not to be interrupted for trivial stuff. When well, an iron sword is not that hard whatsoever, I just need to get this piece of wood here. And then, oh, well, I already had wood too. So there we go. Make ourselves an iron sword. There we go. Look at that. Butte. And we are done. Ah, uh, just about time. Hold up there a second. Here's your armor. It's been a long time on that. Thank you for my work. Why don't you? Uh, one enchanted protective set of armor. And now you already have a sword set too. So you now have your starter to go. So we are good. Go to your team officer. They'll have something for you. Ooh. Articuno armor. This armor is given by the blacksmith. Ooh. Show your allegiance to the unified minds. Yeah, unified minds. Oh, we get speed boost and saturation from that. That's sick. All right. So visit our team leader. This is our team leader here all right then i guess you have your armor and you have your sword and tools what else does any respecting trainer need to go out on their journey ah, i guess i suppose a pokemon might be needed many trainers start off with the pokemon they choose from their local area however you now belong to those hypno lot they all train using ponyta here take this and begin your journey actually take these pokeballs too in case you want to get a friend Ooh. Well, what are you standing around here for? Just exit the cave and follow the path. There we go. Perfect. So we got a Galarian Ponyta to start off with. Oh, that's awesome. So I'm assuming its special attack is its best thing. So let's do slash IVs six here okay so you came up with zero special attack and three speed so you're not someone i will use but it does complete my help with my pokedex and it's a galarian form so that's super sick all right so it says we need to head out of the pathway of the cave and leave is it that way then because we came in this way so i don't know if we would leave this way again but we'll try it first just in case you can go this way well that told us right away that's perfectly fine by me you can only use storyline pokemon beyond this point please put all your other pokemon in your pc ah okay Okay, that's interesting so let's do that oh i finally went out the same way i came in i just had to originally get rid of my pokemon I'm like i checked every other entrance of every other side of this place okay we have left where are we okay this is the exit of the cave there's a person over there i have no idea what we're supposed to be doing we don't have a quest for this storyline at the moment do i talk to you Ah, one has sad little trainer gotten lost now. One of those hypno brats too. Well, this is gonna be fun. Task list. Ooh, oh, oh, you have a level one Krogunt. That's so cute. Confusion. Bye bye. Oh, task completed. Pfft, whatever. Yeah, I'll find and tell you where the dumb headquarters is. Run along the path over the river, and then it's that huge floating tower on the right of the hill. You can't really miss it. Uh, you should probably head over to your base from the clues everyone gave. Okay. 
big tower over the river past the church okay so big tower over river past the church um, I'm assuming this is the church. So this is gonna be really, really, really interesting. Ah, oh, there's another person. Do I talk to you too? What's done is done. We say it's done. Desperate times, desperate measures. This is Tom Cruise? Ah! He don't have purple eyes. What are you talking about? That, that's an imposter of Tom Cruise. So do we go left or right? Let's go right. Because I... No, that's a windmill. I'm assuming we go left then. Oh, there's so many people. I'm assuming each of these people I can actually, like, talk to. Oh my god, I kind of want to talk to all of them see what they have to say. I get told to please wait. Ah, can you help me? I need some gold for my blacksmith to make my beloved necklace. They said I need about 15. I have about 10. I mean, okay, we can find some gold. This is going to be really interesting. So, like, when do we get to the more Pixelmon part? We, I mean, we had a one battle, but that was literally made for us to win that battle. So, I guess it doesn't really count. We got XP from it, right? Yeah, we got a little bit of XP. I don't know what this is, but I found a healer. I, I, well, oh, the Wondering TM shop has despawned. Oh, what's this? Duh, does it make you brave to stick your hand in the bear's mouth? Would you do it again just because you didn't die? No, no, I, would, I wouldn't do that again. But thank you for the... I wouldn't have done that in the first place. Bears are scary. No, thank you. Gothita! <gasps> It's a level 25. I'm gonna run. I don't have the Pokeballs or the Pokemon to catch it. Oh, it's a Pokemon I don't have. That makes me so sad. Okay. Okay, that's, that's good to know. There's a, a Lolan Rattata there. So, is this is this my base here? Don't damage the book. Sorcerer Silas. Okay, but I, I Sorcerer, I, I have no idea where I'm supposed to, like, I get I'm supposed to find my base, but, like, I'm a little lost of what my base is supposed to be. Well, I'm pretty sure this is just the fighting dojo, so I don't know what to do. Nothing is more harmful to the world than a martial art that is not effective in actual self-defense. Uh, if a man dwells on the past, then he robs the present, but if a man ignores the past, he may rob the future. All good advice, actually. Really good advice. But, I mean, am I, I, this definitely isn't my base. Let me eat in peace. I'm very sorry. Training is exhausting. Okay, so this is definitely the fighting dojo. But, so where is my base? Alright, well, let's just let's just see what these guys have to say. I'm so ready to leave this place, and you are a level 37 trainer, so I'm not ready to battle you. And you are the Katan, or... Uh, welcome to the docks. What do you have to say? I just got your flits as nice as I've heard. Is that really it? Every single person's got a one-liner here. And you aren't clickable at all. This belongs to an administrator, so I can't even use that. Okay. And these buds clearly aren't our bases. Where are the unified minds base? Seriously, I think I've explored about every part of the outside of this, so I don't know what I'm looking for. It maybe it is that floating tower, but I don't know how to get up to it. Okay, guys, this has to be my base. Like, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. And by the way, what are these Pokemon spawning? What? Cacturn Meganium Victory Bell? Oh, wait, what? I mean you managed to find your an into the tower, maybe you can talk to the leader. How, what, they'll probably be at the top. Wait, wait, what? I'm at the right area, obviously, because it gave me the notification. But how do I find my area and my leader up there? Like, what? What? I'm so confused. Storyline progress. Tale of the three birds. Uh, evolution panel and cancel story point. Well, I don't want to cancel story point. So we, we're supposed to talk to our leader, but I don't know how to get up there. And I'm just, I want to catch these Pokemon. I don't have them in my decks, especially like Meganium. It's a starter. But they're just here. And I have no idea how you actually supposed to get up here. Like, are you supposed to fly or something? Because it just activated as soon as I walked back here. So is there like a secret entrance? Okay, so clearly we're not supposed to go up here because there are magical blocks blocking me after I finally figure out a way up here. So what am I supposed to be doing? You know, I'm just gonna go back to town and enjoy this because I, I'm assuming that we, we have to talk to our leader, right? But if I open my quest for progress tracker, I don't have anything. So I think we should just explore the main area and talk to people and get some more missions. Ah, sir, what do you have to say? Oh, hi there, I need something to help me with my blacksmithing. Are you free? Give me 20 iron, I'll help you gathering this set of Pokemon too. Ah, uh, there you go. Ah, and thanks for your turn. Here's some Pokeballs. Feel free to talk to me again. I always need iron. Ah, so we can always give him iron for Pokeballs. And that give me about 20 Pokeballs. It's actually a pretty decent deal. Hey, have you heard about the town's fault talking around the square? Sometimes they have quests for you, and more may appear if you keep going through the journey. Ah, that's good to know, so let's let you know. Hell, we... Well, hell, here we are in the future. Nothing to fear yet, okay? Uh, any more quests, buddy? I'm assuming you might give me a quest. What about you? Three teams are all at each other's throats. It makes them easy to sell throat spray, but even still, interesting. That belongs to an administrator, so I cannot use that one. Let's go ahead and keep exploring. Ah, my family and I, we sometimes struggle to eat. It's all due to the king and his ruthless taxes. Interesting. Oh, hello there. Do you love this tree? It has special powers, you know. It can teleport you to an enemy 
you may be currently facing. What? Nature surely want it can teleport you to a tree you're- I, but I want to be teleported. It's not teleporting me. It's not working. You lied to me. Theodore Six Eyes. There's lots of peoples in the shadows. Ooh, haha. I'm truly world. King Xander. Wait, you say my crown is paper? What do you mean? Yeah, you're fake, King. You're fake. And I can't talk to you either. I've talked to you, right? I've been selling since I was a young girl when I used to steal my father's shoes and then sell them back to him for a price. That's a clever thing, I guess. So I've explored the main section of the town and spoke to everyone. So I guess we need to go to the outskirts because at this point, I don't know what we're supposed to do to continue because like I can't actually get to my base and I don't know where my team leader is. Okay, my last ditch effort was visit each place next to our, uh, you know, home for our base. And there's a bunch of people here. So let's see what they have to say. The R, I heard R. Kuno is the most intelligent of the three glaring birds. I wonder how it learned everything. Oh, interesting. Have you seen Articuno? It looks so mesmerizing. And what do we have here? You have, I've heard the team leader is at the top of the tower. Does that mean I can actually go to the top of the tower somehow? Ooh, Larvitar, I want you. You know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? I can capture you. I can. Come here. I got Pokeballs. Let's go. Confusion. Beautiful. And he one-shot us. Well, I guess that makes sense, Rock versus Fire. So that's a little difficult to deal with, but oh well. And our Pokemon's dead now, but oh well. Let's just go ahead and... So do we do we head up there? Can I get to the top of the tower somehow? Oh, yeah, you're struggling to get on the tower. Aboard me pad. Ooh. Aboard me pad. There we go. There we go. We've made it. What do you have to say? My wristband needs some more spikes. You know where I can find that? No, I do not. Maybe the blacksmith. I'm not a wizard. I'm a wizard, not a baboon brandishing a stick. Interesting. I'm going to the top of the tower right away just to see the master of our team. And this, is this the top? I don't see a ladder or staircase. So one of these guys is said master. Is it you? You're level 36. You're a trainer. So I'm going to guess not. What about you? Ah, Officer Nicholas, some people think that this is paranoia, but it isn't. Paranoids only think everyone is out to get them. Wizards know it. Interesting for sure. You're level 13. Ah, yeah, well, you want to join up, kid? Let me tell you a bit of history about our group. Long here, the land split into three main noble houses, the houses of three birds. Each house dedicated itself to worshiping these three idols, and it said that one of each which will unite the land once again. The problem, we all don't know which one. Now the land stands divided and the king sits in his crumbling castle not acting on what happens through the realm. We here at the Unified Minds will take matters into our own hands. If they really want to join up, you're really going to have to level up. Go out and beat another 20 other Pokemon and then we'll see what you are made of. So we have to defeat 20 Pokemon? This is not going to be easy, but now we know how to get up here. It should be a lot easier of a time. Plus, we can do this, and it can teleport us back here. Well, I know exactly where I'm going to head to train. The original spot that we had the quest pop up over here for the actual team tower itself because there were grass Pokemon over there. Yes, I know we're psychic and not fire, but grass also tend to be like poison. Now, you, Cactuan, would be a horrible battle because you're also dark. Now, most of these Pokemon are actually going to be bad battles because they're just such high level. So, i got to find something low level if I want a chance. Okay, guys, with two Pokemon undefeated we are on the right path finally so if we we came back to around where the cave section is and over here are a lot lower level pokemon that we can actually battle so this is really really good for us we're gonna go ahead and grind up 20 pokemon and maybe level 20 i don't know it depends on how far these pokemon get us i mean once we get higher levels and better moves we'll be going on better as well but it sucks because we have to run back here each and every time and wait for pokemon to spawn if we die because we don't get our self-healing items like we do in the regular pixelmon world but this will make four Pokemon finished off, so we're making progress. Hey right, guys, we've got about five Pokemon left that we need to capture, but there's a Tangela here, and I'm not passing up on the chance to capture this thing. Whether we want to add him to this version of our team or not, I need him for the Pokedex, and our Pokedex reaches across these worlds, clearly, because I've had Pokemon with the Pokeball symbols where I caught them in the other world, so I know it works. So we're going to try our best to capture this thing, but it's not going to be easy. So Pokeballs, come on. You're level 7, you're half HP. I should probably hit you one more time. Or he's gonna kill me. Yep, uh, yep, 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 yep. Let's try this one more time. Come on, Pokeball. Can I not capture Pokemon? Tangela instantly broke free. That's, is it, it's just instant? Do I not actually get to capture? Yeah, it broke free. So I don't know if there's capturing here or not, I guess. So we're just gonna go forward. Confusion, finish you off. There we go. But we're getting closer to finishing up our 20 Pokemon. We are at 16 out of 20, and we're level 13 now. So we're making good progress. Hey, we're learning a new move. Fairy Wind. Fairy Wind, 40 power... 100 accuracy uses stir stirs up a fairy wind and strikes target with it so let's get rid of growl for that there we go 
That's pretty neat. And I think we officially hit our full 20 out of 20. We did, so now we can head back to our tower. Okay, everyone, let's go talk to our leader. Let me join. I want to join the Unim Unified Montas. Ah, not bad, not a bad at all, kid. I guess you're in. Welcome to the gang. All right, now you're in the gang. We gotta put you to work. Over in the market, you can trade for Pokeballs. You're gonna need some if you wanna prove your team. Go defeat some Pokemon and use the items they drop to trade. G grab 10 string, 5 purple wool, and 10 feathers. Once you do it, bring them to me and I will trade for them. Where to get them, look for Weedle, Apom, and anything that flies. So, that's where we're going to end off today's episode. We're going to hit that up next time, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Especially because we're getting into the needy, greedy, and the more fun stuff of this storyline. And I'll see you all next time, Rockstars. Peace, peace.